I'm the Big Big Gamer. Welcome back to another Tips for Beginners video. I know Leon Tips for Beginners again. The, the wheel. If you don't know, it's been um, a, a a wheel, and um, and if it and it lands on what video I should do. Leon Tips for Beginners again. Uh, so yeah, pretty crazy. But um, yeah. Anyways, we're back with Tips for Beginners. Uh, last time I showed you guys how to be uh, deadlocked, which uh, I think helped a lot of people because I saw uh, some comments saying that. Um, like, uh, that helps and, like, stuff like that. Uh, so, yeah, so, uh, today, we're, I'm gonna show you guys how to do a decode. This was suggested by one of my fans, so, yeah, uh, so, this is a really, uh, good demon once you're starting to get, like, better at the game. Uh, I think this is my 30th demon. Yes! We did it! Oh! So, um, oh, yeah, so, uh, yeah, so, um, I'm gonna turn all the checkpoints off so it's easy to show you guys the level. So, uh, yeah, so this first key part, it's... Not really that hard, just like, it's not as, like, the, it's not as hard as the deadlock beginning cube, it's not too bad. And then we have the ship parts, so, you'd think they'd be able to just, like, go up there, but, uh, no, there's, there's, like, little hidden spikes, you kind of see it, like, right, like, you can kind of see it, that there's, like, black spikes. So, you just gotta strip fly through, it's not too tight of a space. And then, and then we have this UFO part, so, uh, there's a count to this, um, that I do, and, uh, so I do, uh, what I do is this. One, two, one, two, three. One, two, like that. Um, and I might slow that down in video editing. Stars, orbs, or demons, whichever will it be? Sit the brick down, T series, you can't even be level three. You trying to tell me that you're gamer number one, but you miss, click you lose. Um, this part, um, it might bug out for you. It's kind of, it's one of the buggier parts. Uh, just uh, make sure you click on the first ledge and then don't click on the other two, but hit the jump brain. Now we just wait for this part is basically just practice. Make sure you go up there because there's a dead end that will uh, kill you and just spam through. And then we have uh, a ball part here. Now this ball, ball part isn't as bad as Delox, I don't think. So you just gotta go one, two, boom, boom, click, 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 boom. Ah, darn. Yeah, don't click too much or else you'll die. Yeah. And then boom, click right away there. Hit only the first two pick jump rings. And then one, two, three. Make sure it goes as early as possible. Then we have uh, the fast cue part, which is one of the most well-known parts in the level. All right, so uh, so basically, boom, boom. Hit the first two. Jump over that. Choose, like, make sure it go as late as possible. Boom, like that. And then yellow, pink. And then do not hit that blue jump ring. If you hit that blue jump ring, it'll send you right into the spikes. So you just got to make sure you don't hit that hold. And then uh, hit hit the um the first blue jump ring. So yellow, boom, boom, and then pink, and then blue, and then uh, he'll have that pad there. Now this part is the hardest part of the entire level, in my opinion, because it, it's it's like it's it's pretty hard to like um memorize at first because like there's a bunch of portals and stuff. It kind of confuses you before it like, transitions and stuff. But um I, I'm gonna give you a count right now. I definitely will slow this part down in video editing so it can kind of help you. So um one two one two. Oh jeez! One two, one two, one bum, ba da da, ba da da. I'll slow that down in video editing so it's a little bit easier to follow. So best thing you haven't won. When I'm through with you, I will leader or ban you for all time. Cause your stats are such a lie. I review them. Awful but nice try. So come on, T series, looking hungry for some drama. Just get rid of all. One of the hardest parts. I'll just keep practicing. You'll get. It. Now we have the notorious wave part. Just kind of follow these plus signs. That's what I do, and just like spam a lot like this. Um, up and down. Now this part it can be pretty hard because of, like of uh, that part uh, coming up, uh, go coming up where you uh, you go up there is kind of hard. Uh, but the but the first part isn't too bad. You just gotta fly up and then slow. Don't click too much and then get in that portal straight fly through and then don't do anything here. And then here we have the last uh, Q part. Um, so you gotta um. So this bar I might also slow down. I'm not sure. That's a bad checkpoint placement. Yeah, but a good tip for practice mode is make sure that your checkpoints are placed well, or else it might bug out. So click, click. Oh my gosh. Click, click. Boom, boom. You can also hold for the first two clicks. Click, 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 click. Your hacks and modding, hacks and modding, hacks and modding. T series ain't nothing without hacks and modding, hacks and modding. Hacks and modding. Look at T series, all their stats are harshly falling. Hacks and modding. Hacks and modding. T series ain't nothing without hacks and modding. Hacks and modding. Hacks and. And there you go. So uh, that's the code by Wreckage. I will slow down some parts so it's easier to follow. I know this tutorial uh, was a little bit faster than the deadlocked one, but this level isn't is isn't as hard in my opinion. Like, once you practice it a lot. Um. Like, this all didn't take me as long as Deadlock, so, 
Uh, yeah, cause that, cause that's, cause like, yeah, that's when you get experience with the game once you beat Deadlock. So, yeah, so yeah, this level isn't too bad. Um, so yeah, so um, um, so yeah, so this level will be easy once you beat Deadlock. So I recommend beat Deadlock before you do this. Um, unless you're freaking like a legend, you can do this after like club step. Um. But, uh, yeah, so, yeah, that's how, uh, that's some good tips for Decode by Wreck Edge. Sorry, this video's a little bit shorter, but, uh, this level's pretty easy. It's not too hard to explain. Um, again, some good mouse recommendations. G502, best, pro probably the best gaming mouse out there, in my opinion. Um, or, like, um, the Razer. That's a, another good one that people like. Um, and then keyboard, like, Razer keyboard. I might make a whole video just talking about what, what, like, equipment is good for Geometry Dash, including, like, monitors and stuff. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'll uh, leave a like if you, if this helped you. Uh, subscribe to the channel below. We are, um, at, we're currently at 13.1k, which is pretty crazy already. <laughs> we're, we're growing pretty strong so far. So, yeah, uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Row to freaking 20k. Um, make sure also follow me on my social media in the description below. Join my Discord server if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.